Fellas, here's a little tip on going to the gym. Wear deodorant. Okay, I don't know why some of y'all think that walking around smelling funky is an attractive trait. I can't tell you how many guys I've had to work out next to smell like ass and bad breath had a baby. Like my goddamn eyebrows about to burn off. My eyes! My eyes! So do yourself a favor. Go buy one of them travel deodorants, put it in your bag, and bring it to the gym just in case. We thank you in advance. What's up, everybody? How lovely to see all your bright, happy faces smiling up at me. It's your man here, Jackson's Gambit, with another video for you. Hope everybody's having an awesome day. In today's video, a woman caused a car accident and seems to be pretty liquored up. Now, I'm sorry, I have a bad memory and it slipped my mind. So when you watch this video, can you tell me what her job is? Hi, you guys okay? Yeah, I was supposed to make a left, but I went to the wrong street. I went to pick him up because I'm going to be honest with you, I he was drunk and I went to pick him up. Okay. I'm a nurse. I'm a nurse. <laughs> Fair enough. And I'm All so right. scared. <laughs> you guys okay? Do you need an ambulance? Do you need no, anything? No, I just need to get him home because he dropped, he was like, call me, pick me up. That's my nephew. He was like, just pick me up, take me home. And I'm like, okay, I will drop you off home. But this is not me dropping. Like, that's my nephew. Okay, where were you supposed to turn? You said I'm you a were... nurse. I'm a huh? nurse. Um, I hear you. I see that. <laughs> I was like, are you like, I see that. No, I am a nurse. So that's fine. I was asking you where you were trying to turn. I was trying to make a left. I picked up my nephew. Okay. Make a left at uh, Dempster, I believe. Picked him up because he was at his friend. And then I jumped to my pasta. And I was like, bro, like, I just picked up. Okay. But I'm a nurse assistant. Well, I heard I you say that like seven times. <laughs> I feel like I covered something like this in my last video. There's literally nobody being my daughter alive. Like, I don't want it. No what's happened with that. Yep. Sounds like another person using something specific in their lives in order to get them out of trouble. But will it work this time around? Not gonna happen. Not gonna happen! No, not gonna happen! <laughs> but what I did catch is your ass slipping up and saying I before saying that he, the other person in the car, was drunk. You ain't slick here. We listen to everything. I'm okay. Okay. But it's just the fact that my brother's there... calling me like, oh, come and pick me up because my girlfriend's being a bitch. Who's not going to pick up the brother? You called him your nephew earlier, so is it your brother or your nephew? No, that's my nephew. I'm sorry. I'm a nurse. So where'd you pick him up from? No, I meet him at the bar. Okay. Did you have any drinks? No, I really didn't. Liar, liar, plants for hire. That was like, oh God, no, I really didn't. All right, but well, what bar was it? Um, I can look it up. Give me one second. It was my first time You don't know where you just there. left? It was my first time going there. Okay. It wasn't like, oh my gosh, something crazy. I would be like, oh my gosh, I'm crazy. I am a nurse. I, I know, you nurse. don't have to tell me that again. You've literally told me 25 really... times that okay, you're a nurse. Okay, I'm sorry if I'm being honest with you. I am I'm a not, nurse. I'm not I saying that you're not being honest. I'm just saying you keep saying the same thing over and over and over again. I'm sorry that I'm just being honest to you that I'm okay. a nurse. Okay, we get the fact that you're a nurse. Can we get back to the subject at hand, which is the accident that you're just in? Being a nurse in this situation is not like going to a restaurant and getting a senior discount. You think I walk into Popeye, say I'm black and I get free shit? There are no exceptions. Being a nurse is not a get out of jail free card. Do you think that you, if everything pans out here, do you think you can drive your car home? Oh, 100%. Are you serious? Yeah, you think your car is operational? Not at this moment, no, because what the hell, what happened? 
You tell me. That's what I'm trying to figure out. And I'm so rushing. Like, I'm not even lying to you. You can actually tell me, like, oh, I'm going to arrest you for this. You can arrest me. You you can go right ahead and arrest me for this. I have money to bail myself out. Well, what do you mean arrest but you for not, this? it's what, not even What am I going to no, arrest you for? No, listen to me. I'm uh, just no, you me. listen to me. No, you listen to no, me. No, that's not how it goes here. No, no. What I am I going to arrest you, you for? You want to press charges on me? What go am I going right to arrest you for? Go right ahead. What no, am I going to arrest you for? Me. What am I going to me. arrest you for? Because, like, oh, she's being a... She, she's that's, not a, like, that's not an arrestable offense. What would I be arresting you for right now? Because you're over here thinking that I'm talking back to you and you're over here. Oh, I don't like, care. You can say whatever you want to me. I'm not you're being not rude. No, you you're, know you I'm weren't. Not being rude. You weren't. I'm but now you're, now you're starting to get an attitude. All I'm I did not getting was, an attitude. All I did was ask you if you think that your car can drive right now. Hey. Now, I know some Latinas can get a little spicy when they have conversations, but you better tone that shit down. You talking to cops. You ain't talking to your family. Don't play that arrest me bullshit. Because we all know y'all want to change your mind when them cuffs really come out. Hit me. Hit me. Hit me. If cops could arrest people just because they were being assholes, a lot of out there would be in jail right now. I f so for hanging around with the same people again. Reel me into your conversation. I don't think we're having the same conversation here. But then I I'm hanging out with the same people again. Okay. <laughs> and I'm a nurse and I'm just like, why did I hang out with my ex-boyfriend again? Is the person that's going in the ambulance your ex-boyfriend? Yeah. Yes? So he's, yeah. your, he's your brother, he's your nephew, he's and a, he's your ex-boyfriend. He's a piece of shit ex-boyfriend. Why did I hang out with him? I don't f***ing know. I don't so, f***ing know. So is that your brother, your no, nephew, or your ex-boyfriend? Okay. I'm assuming this is the part of the conversation where we get to the heart of it all. You know, the nitty gritty. So if this is true, sounds like you can't let go of your ex. Is it because you're a nurse? Well, my next question would be, why lie about it? Why say he's your nephew, and now your brother, and now your ex-boyfriend? This in no way to the cop affects the fact that you just got into a car accident. I will say this though, you would have been better off where you were than picking his ass up. Oh, I'm gonna be honest, I'm gonna be honest, I was not drinking. I told him, I was like, I would drink, who drinks and that's it. And they're like, okay, okay. They're like, oh no, you're just gonna drink and this and that. And I was like, no, you guys don't understand. I'm okay. I'm okay. Okay, so you only had two drinks? No. I promise you on my God's life. I put that on get everything. Only I put two? two drink. I put that on God. Yeah, two drinks. That's it. That's it? Okay, That's when did it. you I have those drink drinks? Anymore. That was probably like two hours ago. Right. Do you believe that? If you said no... You smart. I promise you on everything. I okay. put it on everything. Did you take I, any no, pills no or call, drugs? No, or? no drugs. I, I put that on everything. You can take a drug test for you to take like, oh, did she take cold? Did she take weed? Would you be willing to take a drug test? Yes, yes. Yeah. You do realize that you were still drinking and driving, right? Are you yes, be willing to give like, us because I was your like, blood or your urine for I that? didn't take no weed. I didn't take nothing. I put it on God. I really didn't. I'm okay. a nurse assistant. Like, I will be honest to you. Okay, are you a CNA or are you a nurse? No, I'm a nurse. With a lot of tech to test determined that was a lie. <laughs> so are you a nurse or a nurse's assistant? Look, either job is nothing to be ashamed of. But if you're an assistant, don't try to give yourself an inflated title. Hey man, tell me what you do for a living. Oh, uh, I pick up trash and I clean a school. Oh, so you're a janitor? No, I'm a sanitation engineer. So, a janitor. Again, no shade, but let's call a spade a spade. Can we go over here? Let's just walk up on the sidewalk. Now the, the sidewalk, okay? This is the grass. Okay. Can you walk up there for me? Right? Yeah. No, you're not doing any tests right now. I just want you to walk to the sidewalk so we're away from your Go car. Go right ahead. Can you please just walk over to the sidewalk? Yeah. Okay. okay. Thank you. Okay. 
Elizabeth, I'm not asking you to do any tests. I just wanted you to come over to the sidewalk, okay? I'm like, oh, I'm serious, like. Why are you messing up left and right? What kind of test were you doing? I ain't never seen a test like that before. Okay, Elizabeth. So many. Elizabeth, I will listen to your whole story in a little bit. I just want to get. How many times? How many times? Tell me. To get the out of my life. To get out of my life for me to be good. It's okay. It's okay. okay. Come to the sidewalk. No, because you guys are. Assholes. You guys don't understand that. Like, should I just move on? Should I just move on? I know what you're going through. I've been there before. But this is not the time for a therapy session. We gonna need you to hold this shit together. But in these kinds of situations, yes. I think you should move on. Don't judge me, You bro. need to come behind your back, okay? Okay, well you already got me, then. What the no. You slipped out of it, down, okay. Elizabeth. Please stop, Elizabeth. Please stop. Okay, then let me go. Please stop, okay, Elizabeth. Go. Please stop. Bro, stop. Elizabeth, Elizabeth, stop. 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 Let me go. No, Elizabeth, you need to stop. You have to stop. Let go of my hand, Elizabeth. Resisting is only making it worse for you right now, okay? Stop resisting us. You're under arrest. It is what it is. Okay, all right. You can let okay. me go. No, we're not letting you go. You can play that. Yes. Play yes. Play we're going to try this again, okay? What the f hey, hey, relax, the relax. Okay. Relax. Elizabeth, please sit down in the car, okay? Put your foot in for me. Sit back for me, okay? <laughs> it's not he cheated on me. <laughs> Sometimes things happen for a reason. I mean, it sucks that it had to go down like this. But sometimes we need shit like this to happen in order to let us know that we fucking up. Though I don't know if you're going to be able to call yourself a nurse after this. But you sitting there crying over a boy. How about focusing on the fact that you could have hit somebody? He's your ex for a reason. Try to keep it that way from now on. But... That's all I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed today's content. Please enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll see you tomorrow in the next one. All right? Later days, y'all.